Hello and welcome back to the mix up in the studio again with uh, Mike Nificent Mike. So uh, we just did uh, Up Church's remix to uh, Broadway, Broadway Girls, Girls, which is a Little Dirk song featuring Morgan Wallen. Okay. And um, this is the original. Yes. And, and it start like the first time it was heard was uh, Morgan Wallen on Instagram and TikTok released a clip of his verse. Okay. And everybody was like, what is this? And it's funny because this is kind of like a, a comeback thing, if you think about it. Like, Morgan was, uh, he, he said he said something that some people have a pass on in certain neighborhoods with certain people to one of his friends that wasn't meant in a derogatory manner at all, but got blown up and his label, like, canceled him for a little while. But then, like, Damn, he, it's like that. Cancel culture. Yeah. So he almost got, like, completely canceled and then, like, had crazy comeback. So, I mean, crazy comeback from doing that to now in, in, a, in a rap song with Lil Durk. Okay. I have no freaking clue who Lil Durk was until I heard this song. Well, I'm excited to hear this. We just heard the remix. We did, which was up church and it was fire. Yes. And this is Morgan Wallen and, and Lil Durk. That was Chase Matthews and Upchurch. And like I said, Chase Matthew did... I keep on saying Matthews. It's Chase Matthew. Matthew, yes. Chase keep, Matthew. I keep messing that up. And um, his verse was the same verse that Morgan used in this song. Okay. So a little more prominent on the, on the Nashville strip. Like, they're even a little more prominent with it. And... Nashville's well, I've been to Nashville. It's okay, a beautiful well, town. Well, well, here's the thing. These guys shut down the roads and everything to record their video. They did. Yeah. Up church Up Church called his boy and said, get down here and let's do this video. Yeah. So there's the difference. There's a difference. Okay. So, having listened to, to Chase Matthews sing the verse, or, or spit the verse, because it's more like a rap verse, and then listen to Morgan spit it, what what, what one do you think? I, I think Chase sounds better. Yeah, so that's, that's a very interesting question, and the answer is, I also think Chase sounds actually much better. But there's something with the the video presentation I mean, of this right now with Little Dirk, where they're the the theme of it and like girls dancing and partying, like it has a it has a deeper feel on, on that level. Where so you're saying video wise, video wise, just the overall feel, like you said, they close out the roads, you know, like yeah. they're doing it big time. So the answer is, I felt Chase Matthews' lyrics and singing like more, but I like what they're bringing. Like, uh, I'm saying voice wise. Voice wise, yeah, but I like what they're bringing in the video right uh, now. So I, I, I was talking about the verse, not talking about the video. Okay, we are watching a video. But... I, I know, but I was speaking on the same verse sung by two different artists. Yeah, so I I definitely like it better from Chase. Oh, Matthew, but there's just something about the little Dirk that like the energy's getting me hyped. <laughs> Are you a little Dirk, a little, little Dirk Mark or something like? <laughs> Apparently, Mike is a little Dirk fan. I never heard of him till tonight. Oh yeah, my ass. <laughs> Apparently, you know who he is. I have never heard of him. <laughs> Until I heard this song, you you obviously know who Little Dirk is. I have no idea. Oh yeah, okay. The black guy with the dreadlocks. That's Little Dirk, right? I I believe. <laughs> I believe so. Okay, I'm just. I'm pretty sure that. you know who he is because when I brought up the song earlier, you're like, oh. Little Dirk, I know who Little Dirk is. He's not the guy in the mullet singing, right? <laughs> okay, all right. I'm glad we cleared that up. <coughs> oh shit! <coughs> now this is before 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 Little Dirk. 
the guy with the dreadlocks that, uh-huh. that you obviously know who it is, and I had no fucking clue who it was until I fucking seen this. <laughs> what I'm saying is, I think Upchurch's verse is way better. That's all I'm saying. Because they come in at the same part in the song, so just listen. Hold on, time out. So I stick to my original answer with regards. So he hasn't even started rapping or singing yet, but okay. all I see is girls. Girls, saw, girls everywhere. Yeah, and like I'm already into the video. Like they could rap it or sing about anything. Girls, girls, <laughs> girls everywhere. They could rap <laughs> or sing about anything, and I'm I'm sucked in right now. Or like just, the, just the, by the, the video. video, the aspect, the well, entire vibe has right, got so, me. All right, so. Oh, up church was a hundred thousand times better. <laughs> exactly. Now that all the smoke and mirrors and all the, the, the I mean, he comes in full auto. Listen, tune. there's a well endowed chick riding a bull. Okay. <laughs> All right, that's all. That's all I saw for a minute. Like, yes, now, yes, now that we've listened to the verse musically, a thousand times better. So yeah, now that they put the camera on him, I'm not feeling it. <laughs> like, cause in the first. Part of his verse, they were showing. You so, know, so like, wait a minute. So Mike, Mike's a pure sucker. He sees the girls in the video and he's like, "Ooh, I like the girls in the video." And he's like, "Bobbing his head to the song." It's, and then the next thing you know, Mike's Mike's fucking singing along to the stupidest song in the world. Fruit. It's not real fruit, but um, I fell for it. Yeah, Up Church and um, Chase. And Chase no, like, this sounds like Saturday Night Live compared to them. Like, <laughs> like seriously. That's, I feel so, like this so, is like... So you're saying that, that after listening to the remix, you find that the remix should be more the original musically, than the remix. A thousand, a so, thousand So you're times. saying after listening to Up Church and Chase, you feel like this is the remix. Oh and that's yeah, the original. they got me visually. This is like with a parody of that, is what you're saying. Yes, now that I've actually listened to it and all the mm-hmm. stuff that was making me not listen to it before, yes, this this is. You yeah, see, what would would have been nice is if is if Morgan wasn't so stuck on his label and everything and trying to clean up his image and not wanting to do things like have up church with him. Is so if they on. actually had church jump on this song. So time out. When you said Morgan to begin with, I thought you were talking about a woman. So now it's I know I understand it's the guy with the mullet. So all right. Okay. I'm with you. Let's let's keep let's going into this. Yeah, so the the Chase Matthew and Upchurch was way more entertaining. Are you telling me this guy's name is Morgan? Yeah, his name is Morgan. I actually know a guy named Morgan. Okay, I, hey. I actually, you know, there, there's the. Uh, have you ever I met a black met guy any... named Stacy? No, I've met a couple black guys named <laughs> Stacy. <Okay. laughs> All right, <laughs> or or like a guy named Shannon. Mm-hmm. I've met a couple guys named Shannon. Listen, man, one of my friends' name is um Kelly Woo, Kelly Woo. So, yeah. And I had him saved in my phone as Kelly. Well, Ke- and, Kelly's another one. So I started saving him under something else because I'm like, what if a chick goes to my <laughs> phone? And I'm like, who the fuck is Kelly, you know? <laughs> like, true story. I'm not even not even joking. Who is Kelly? <laughs> no, that's Kelly Woo, baby. <laughs> that black guy's name is not Kelly. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out I to swear Kelly. That's Wu. him. That's him. He's like, we LV and him have an interview on the channel still. Ke- Kelly's an awesome guy. Shout out to uh, Kelly Wu, Jungle Wombat. So again, I'm sucked into the visuals. They had the street cleared out. Upchurch did so, not. So th- this part of the song. Up Church and Chase didn't use so like Morgan's little like second verse here they didn't use in the in the remix. 
But I'm feeling the whole because I've been to Nashville and just seeing them like in the downtown strip, like I'm 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 jaded by it right now. Seriously. But I told them that I'm savage. They just trying to tell me that. Yeah, in true story, I've never heard of Little Dirk before. I have no clue who Little Dirk is. Somehow, I seriously doubt that that is a true statement. Huh? Okay. I really doubt that that you <laughs> didn't know who Little Dirk was. Magnificent. I'm a passionate guy. If I make a statement, you know, I'm pretty oh, confident. Okay. With I'm it. pretty sure you knew who Little Dirk was because you were like excited when I said Little Dirk. I was like, Little Dirk of Morgan Well, and you're like, Ooh, Little Dirk. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, Little Dirk. That sounds like a dance, like Little Dirk. He, he, little Dirk. He did the little leprechaun jig over there. He's like, I eat it, eat it, eat little Dirk. Yeah. <laughs> oh, shit. By the way, um, I'm very picky about this. Um, I only like a, a female with real hair. With real hair, you don't you, you don't like girls that wear wigs. I, there's just something about it, and I don't know why I'm thinking of this. But do you think Little Dirk's hair is real? Probably, probably. I mean, there are a lot of guys out there now that do get like a like guys with wigs extensions. You know, when it comes to dreads, yo, if there anyone are out, a lot of guys that get fake dreads. If anyone out there knows if Little Dirk has extensions, please comment. Like, like, um, from what I hear, F Fetty Wap, his, his dreads were were um, weaved in. Okay, that's what I've heard. So it's happened. So it's happened. Okay. And what about the mullet, Morgan's mullet? Do you think that's real? Oh, that's definitely okay. <laughs> All the right. mullet's real. I'm just, I'm seeing everything here. I'm taking it in. So, final thoughts. Yeah. So the remix is a thousand times better. Um, yes. I like the glitz and glam. I mean, everything I mean, that glitters ain't gold, but I like this the the video particularly. I mean, I mean, don't get me wrong. Mor Morgan's got some good songs out there. She, I mean, he, yes, he does. Uh, you're, you're, you're still confusing the name. Oh, okay, right. Yeah. Him. Him. He's, he's not, not one of them alphabet community people. Either. I'm going to check out some more <laughs> Little Dirk. I don't know if I'm going to look up Morgan, I but. I don't think I'm going to look up Little Dirk. <laughs> I don't think so. Definitely not. I was feeling the remix, though. All right, yeah, Mike felt the remix better. I obviously, I, I like both, but the remix better, yes, of course. And uh, until next time, this has been The Mix-Up. Peace. Magnificent. Out.